Dear students, let us learn how to create a component for our transistor which comes in a T39 or a T09 package. So you launch this component editor. Okay, I'll get this and uh, so as discussed in previous sessions, so you have to create a new library. So I'll create new uh, transistor library transistor user library and uh, should need to select this user component and say OK. So it is, uh, let us say, it will create uh, uh, TR So it's a transistor and uh, name will be the letter, let us say it is T Then minimize this as you know for the transistor there will be three pins or terminals okay for base uh, collector and emitter then change the property of the pins double click on this so let it be like 150 mils then so position is uh, I will display, display it in the, on the screen. So for a base, uh, the length is 150 mil and uh, the position of that is minus triple one point nine nine. Okay. So to change, double click on this and it is the same 150 mil. Then for a collector, so it is 150 mil. So position is let us check the position for the collector is 88 in uh, x coordinate 88 and uh, y coordinate 100 mils so rotate that rotate this also the collect diameter terminal change the coordinates so length is 150 mil and this is again 88.01 x position and y position is minus 100 mils ok now you are ready with the 3 terminal then you have to draw a circle over here select this and uh, draw the circle Okay, to change the property, double click on this. So the height and width is 300 mils, and uh, positions are 0, 0. Okay, this could be same, or you can make it as 10 mils. So this is now our circle. Then you have to draw a line for that. Okay. So let us draw the line. How you draw? Select this. Then you 
page or diode like symbol to create that select this Save this. So, to create a pattern for the transistor. So let us launch this pattern. Okay, so to create pattern as you know that we have to uh, create a new library. So here let us uh, say it is my transistor this library and transistor insert component. So let us say it is a 2L equal to 18 transistor and uh, reference name for that is Q. Then minimize this. So keep the uh, your measurement unit in mils to do that. So we have units and uh, select mil. Okay, for a transistor there are three terminals, so we need three pads. One, two, and three. Okay, then change the pad properties. So let it be full and uh, rectangle size is like 59.06 Hidden width of the uh, pad, and let us say this is the uh, little 26.7 mils, and uh, this uh, axis so that is minus 100 mil, and uh, y axis it's on a zero axis. Okay, so we did not get the full. Select this and uh, through all and rectangle round and so twenty six point seven. is a rectangle okay so for this you change the property and uh, so it should be near to the center and it should be 100 mils from the center It is 100 minutes from center. Likewise, uh, change the property for each pad. So, so drag this near to the center. Ok, 
Okay, now let us measure the distance between this pad and this pad. So it should be 200 mils from center of this to center of this. It should be 200 mils and. Uh, so is a round and the through hole is a Now measure the distance between this center of this pad and this pad should be approximately 141.42. Let us see if it is having a see having a correct distance in mils 141.42. Let us measure the distance between this and this. So this is for your reference. The dimension you should remove it later. Okay, otherwise it will come in a silk screen. When you take a printout, it will come for a silk screen. Then it is having one transistor footprint is having one oval shape. So let us uh, draw one oval shape and uh, change its property. Like uh, I want to keep it 400 mil and should be centered around the x and y axis ok so this is the uh, shape of the transistor to identify emitter keep one notch here so how you will keep draw notch uh, if this is my emitter draw notch here So if you are not able to size four point five mil and okay, remove this. Now, this is how the open for the transistor looks like. So, save this with a proper name. So, I'll save it to an 12 to 1 pattern. Save and uh, remove this dimension. Okay, so we have seen this. Uh, now let us uh, attach uh, the pattern for the component editor. Launch this component editor. Procedure is same for attaching the pattern. This pattern with its uh, uh, component. Okay, let us uh, select user component and 
the component. I have created one transistor. Okay. So this is the transistor. Created a transistor for. Created a transistor. Okay. To this, I have to attach a pattern. So how you attach both component and uh, attach pattern? Select. Pattern and uh, pins are mapped meter, uh, base, and uh, collector. Okay, so let us change here. So, this is my emitter, and uh, so for pin number three, it should be attached. And uh, pin number two, two and pin number one, three. Okay. Now, now one, three. Okay. That is fine. For an emitter, this is the pad. For base, this is the pad. And for collector, this is the pad. So just say okay and uh, save this. So you need to check whether the pattern is see you can see that the pattern has been attached to our uh, component and uh, you can use it in uh, drawing the PCB layout.